Oh, yeah. whoa. He's about to murk you. Oh, shit! Yo, what is up, everybody? We are back for more Alan Wake 2. Last episode, we were at the old folks' home. We fought Cynthia Weaver. That was pretty cool. We lit her up, filled her full of bullets. She is now gone. Um, we saw the cutscene with her talking to Alan, basically saying, yo, I got the clicker. I can get it to you. You cannot write Logan into the story, however. You need to write her out. Obviously, we know she does not realize that Alan cannot hear everything she's saying. They're basically getting bits and pieces of what each other are saying. It's, it's kind of hard for them to work together. Together. Obviously, as a mother, as a parent, she's pissed. You're this there's this horror story going on. You got my daughter involved. You need to get her out of it. So I, it's gonna be interesting to see how Saga's story goes, especially since we had a little bit of that poem where we feel like Saga is gonna come out of this alive and Alan is not. I don't know if that's what's happening, but when we read that poem, that's kind of where we took it. So now where we left off, we were about to talk to grandpa. So let's see how this conversation goes. We're gonna go ahead and dive right in. And he we need to talk. <sighs> Damn right. Lots for me to explain. But not here. The knight's got ears. We can have our talk in your head. Oh, in the mind you place, because they can do that. There, right? yeah. How do you know about that? I'm All Andersons can do it. He was like he was explaining. <laughs> what don't I know? But yeah, I was saying that um it's also like not even if he did hear her say like write her out the story it would have been too late because he wasn't able to finish the story yeah so he wouldn't have been able to do Tori's anything. here in the overlap gotta find him and get the fuck out <laughs> well that's done anger's remorse mentioned the man i drove away what man did Tori drive away my father which would make sense mm-hmm See, area on the overlap is always flooded. The overlap. Yeah. I entered the dark place by paying Tor and Odin's song. How, How to enter. enter. Overlaps require pieces of art to enter. Is that because of the dark place's focus on dark art? Mm -hmm. Yeah. Putting the heart through the hole, the float. The song. Okay, for, for later. later. Let me just make sure I don't have anything extra that I can look through. No? Mm -mm. Okay, time to profile. Oh, we didn't finish profiling her? Cynthia was close to someone named Thomas Sane. Who is he? Tom was back. Tom had enemies. And a fancy old tale. Just his imagination. A nightmare started to creep in. Cynthia Weaver smiled. And that was the hotel we played in as Alan. Maybe Tom was taken. Okay. Well, let's do this first. You know about my mind place? How is that possible? We all have the power. Mm hmm Find the truth. Damn right I do. Odin already told you you're a seer. You can gaze into their heads, see the truth. See past the lies. Past this bullshit horror story. Us Andersons aren't bound by it. You can mm, fight it. So she can fight it, her and daughter that's why being they the were story. fighting the story. it too. Mm -hmm. Like they weren't being Make taken control of so easily. It's true. I am a seer. That's good news for Logan. I have a power. My mind place is more than I thought it was. This isn't my intuition. I'm seeing their thoughts. Is this why I know the truth about Logan? While well, mm. everyone else forgot. Yeah, because she's not so easily roped into the story. You said you were my grandfather. If that's true, why wasn't I told about you? You were part of our fucked up family way before this horror story. Okay. I was a shitty fucking dad to Freya. Mm -hmm. Your mom didn't deserve that. And that's why she didn't not want to talk bit. about them. Things were said and done. 
Not a day goes by, I haven't regretted it. But that fucking father of yours didn't make yeah, things any easier. Yeah, when we were on the mine board, she's like, what man did he drive away, my dad? I know Freya is gone. So I need to apologize to you. I am sorry, Saga. I can see he's sorry. Mom said she didn't want anything to do with my grandfather. Mm-hmm. And that my father died before I could remember. It all matches. Tor and Odin are part of my family. Yeah, let's find out about Dad. Mom wouldn't talk about my father. You knew him? Some doors are better left closed. Your dad was a complicated bastard. Always mm -hmm. thinking too many steps ahead. That's not how we work. There was trouble, and then he was gone. I didn't handle it well. Freya didn't want anything to do with me after that. I can't blame her. I never knew my dad or my mom's family. So many broken relationships in my past. That sucks. Mm -hmm. I won't lose mine. With Logan. With David. I won't stop until they're safe. Love you, Mom. You said you were a shitty father to my mom. Is that why she left? Freya never looked back. My girl was strong. Freya always thought our powers had a dangerous side. Odin and me did fuck with things that should not have been fucked with. Your mom had common sense. She raised you right. Kept you safe. I'm not surprised she didn't tell you about the Anderson power. Mm -hmm. She was always protecting Yeah, me. she didn't want her to Whenever fuck around and do something bad. Place, she called it make-believe. Wow. But... I wish she'd been more honest with you. Yes, me. she said, mm -hmm. that's what I was going to say, but... At especially as she got end. older. Yeah, that's what she said, at least towards the end, because you can try to be, like, honest with a child up front, and then you tell them, hey, kind of like in that show we were watching, and she was like, don't use your powers over the lake at nighttime. Okay, yeah. It's like that. It's like you tell them not to do something, and then they go do it, the freak, anyway. Yeah. You know? I have the clicker. Can I use it to save my daughter? An app. Get your guitar roaring and your drums crashing. Blow reality's eardrums. Just the light switch isn't enough. It's Tom's story we're dealing with, so he's got to be the one to rewrite it. After that's done, he can flick that switch to bring the whole thing home, baby. I can't use the clicker without wig. Tom. Meaning mm -hmm. wig. Which I figured. He needs to rewrite the story first. I can't stop the horror story without him. Okay. The clicker acts like an amplifier. It can magnify the reality changing effects of art. So Wake writes a story, the dark place makes it change reality, and the clicker amplifies that change, making it permanent. Makes sense. So yeah, that whole shit about her daughter is crazy because Wake wrote the story, only Wake can edit it. Wake oh. needs to be the one to rewrite the ending. And I'll need to keep an eye on him. Yeah, this is gonna get very interesting. Mm -hmm. Wake wrote Logan into the story. He had no right to use her like this. That's fair. There's mm -hmm. still time to make him fix it. I won't give him a choice. Damn. Tor. Mom thought Tor's power was dangerous. Didn't want me around it. Okay. But well, I don't think, I don't think. Um, you don't think what? Alan drowned Logan. I think the dark place drowned her. What do you mean? Alan wrote Logan into the story for some other purpose, but the dark place is manipulative and tries to interfere like how it drowned Cynthia when she lost the clicker because it had said something about pulling uh, somebody under. So I think the dark place 
killed Logan. I don't think that Alan wrote her to die. Okay, we'll see. The way Tor behaved? I'm surprised my mom hung around for as long as she did. Our family is not bound by But he is story. genuinely sorry. But my thing is, did Alan know about the seer power or he just so happened to write no, Saga into the story? I, but I, I do think that he wrote her to die, especially with what Tor is saying. Our family is not bound by his story. The Andersons can see through the horror story. And remember, he said that he had to make it bad. Yeah, he had to make it bad, but... So like, I don't know if he's going to... I don't know if he was making it bad to make it right toward the end. We don't know. Because... We'll see. We'll see, yeah. They have to come... They, they have to talk about it. I remember one of the, like, little things that we read or found said something about, like, somebody being dragged and drowned under the dark place. So that's why I just didn't know if it was talking about Logan, like, or that no. that same possibility happened to yeah, Logan. Yeah, no. He literally wrote in the story that she drowned, and that's why everybody remembers it as such. Like, it's not like something that just happened. Like, everybody remembers it as such because she wrote it, and then she just said, I have this power. We're not bound by his story. Is that why I remember her still being alive and nobody else? does mm -hmm. however the clicker is what makes it permanent so she has to make him rewrite the story first before they use the clicker or as an edit amp it. yeah he has to he has to edit the story so that she's not dead and then when they use the amp it will become permanent because they use the amp while she's dead she's really gonna die yeah this would explain why my memories haven't changed like everyone else correct mm -hmm. yeah see all right all the rest of this is for later thanks for telling me this tour i need to go find wake to stop this. The old gods of Asgard will be ready to help. Me and my bro will bring the rock when you need it. Remember, your daughter is alive. Mm -hmm. Just kept from you by this bullshit horror story. I needed to hear that. Mm -hmm. Thanks, Grandpa. Don't He's like, just focus on the fact me, that she's girl. alive. Mm -hmm. Like, she's alive. Get the clicker to wake and make him fix his attempt to play God. That's the plan. But the FBC have him. Saga, you don't understand. I can't do that. I can't wait for the bullshit. All right, for later. Yeah, that's why I said we should save before yeah. we go back into the mine place again. <laughs> The FBC is holding Wake at the Sheriff's Station. I need to make Agent Estevez understand. They have Wake and I have the clicker. What? We have to work together to stop this. Did you see what just happened? No. I cut the Casey, bolt cutters and it teleported me to the other me, side Casey? of the fence. It turned me around. That's why I was like, what? I was over oh, there. Wow. Where are you, Casey? Okay. Yeah, he Casey's... better be okay. Nah, Casey's getting fucked up. Focus, Saga. Get to the station to Wake. This place is messed up. Yeah, we had a whole fight in here. I know. I need, just need to check to make sure I opened all the doors. And let me just talk to these people one last time. Put some clothes on. What if that towel slipped? No one wants to see your meat basket. Your meat, meat basket? Your meat basket is crazy. Literally old niggas in the gym changing. <laughs> Just check upstairs. And then I want to go back to that forest and use the bolt cutters and then find all the stuff that we didn't find that's out there. Mm -hmm. Like, How do we get in there? We don't, we don't have the... They're not locked and unlocked anymore? I don't think that one ever unlocked. Because the only other room we went in was um. We don't still have her key. It won't let me. It it should pull up to let me use it, but it doesn't let me. Was there something on the floor right there to the right? Go in and then look to the right. Oh, okay, no, it was just a reflection. Sorry. Very good. No, I guess we got. I guess we got everything in here that we that we would need. Mm-hmm. We probably come back to that room later, maybe. First floor office is a point of interest that we missed. Hmm. Maybe something else in here? Yeah, that's what I'm thinking. Let's look around. If not, then yeah, the room right is there? just done. No, that was the lunchbox. Oh, okay, what about the desk? No, there's nothing on the desk. Okay, I guess it's just like, sort of like a bug. Okay, just saved. I just found a page.
Saga had slid into a nightmare. A growing amount of evidence said her daughter was dead. Saga couldn't accept that. Wake said it could be undone, but Wake was gone, in the custody of the Federal Bureau of Control. Casey, her only ally, was gone too. She was alone. Agent Estevez had pulled rank on her, stonewalled her, yep. shut her out of her own case. Saga refused to give up. She needed answers. Tor and Odin Anderson would have some. A family visit then. No one could blame her for that. Saga was trapped in a horror story. It was manifesting itself around her like the darkness of a mental illness, pushing her deeper and deeper. So maybe we save now? I Well, hang on. And then try to go in the mine place and see if it works. No, I'm not doing that. I'm looking for something real quick. There we go, over here. Vote Mayor Setter to sit in office. Okay, that was it. There's a save point in there, right? And where? And what, the house we just left out of? No, the save point is in the medical center way back. Oh. I'll, I'll figure it wait. out. Yeah. All right, so we're going to the forest? Yes. If I could just... Oh, we got to drive there? Yeah, I'm just... Well, we didn't drive up here. I just remembered we walked. From through the amusement park? Yeah, we walked up. Right here. Yeah, you should probably heal. Uh. You should probably heal one more time. Because they're going to be coming with the fuckery. Mm -hmm. um, cult stash. I wish I could like mark these places. Oh, you know what? I'm going the wrong way. Okay. So I need... There's... I can use the bolt cutters over there. Is it all the way over there to the right? Yeah, and around? Can I go up here and to the right? around this pond and then I can go back here oh shit another page when Cynthia Weaver was downstairs at breakfast Rose snuck into her room with all the lamps in the room it took her a while to find the one with an angel luckily the dream Alan had sent her had been very clear Rose was certain that Cynthia would not miss one lamp she had so many tonight Rose would put the lamp in a shoebox and let it sink into the garden pond that's what Alan wanted. That's how it That's got how to she him. she could help him. The thought okay. made her whole body buzz with joy. Cynthia knew the lamp was missing the very moment she came back to her room. She was overcome by grief. It had been Tom's lamp, one of the few things that reminded her of him. It had not worked in a long time with the cord severed and the light switch gone. But there are other kinds of lights than the ones we can see. The invisible light of the angel lamp had held Cynthia together all these years. With tears welling in her eyes, she didn't see the shadow shifting in the corners of her room. Oh, the dark presence when it took hold of her and made her a take in. Mm -hmm. Let's see. Rose snuck into her room with all the lamps in the room. It took her a while to find the one with the angel. So Alan wrote that into the story, yes, so that Rose could help him. And that's how we got the lamp at first. That lets mm -hmm. us take the light. Um, tonight, Rose will put the lamp in a shoebox, let it sink. Okay. The invisible light of the angel lamp had held Cynthia together all these years. But then he still let her get clapped by the, the dark presence. This nigga just left it in there. Well, I guess it's a horror story. So like he said, he had to let certain things happen. So. Yep. Because that's the only way that um, Saga was going to get the switch, the clicker. Yeah, because the story has to, and the story has to make sense, which they've harped on repeatedly. All right, now we can go to this. Oh, shit, that scared me. Yeah. Now we can go to this back area. There's a cult stash right there. He's like, ah, she's old. She's lived long enough. Mm-hmm. Bunker Woods. 
What? There's another cult stash. Let's see. Nope. There's a key somewhere. It's pointing me to the key. This way. This way. Wait, what the hell? Is it taking me in a circle? Mm, I don't think so. It is. Shouldn't there be one of those things here? No, that's Alan's playthrough. Oh, yeah, 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 the trait. Um. Okay. I need a key to get in there. But usually everything that, okay, we've learned time and time again that whatever, okay, arrow, this is pointing this way. Yeah, this one's pointing this way. And that one's pointing that way. And that one's pointing over there. This rifle is OD. Okay. You see it? It's over there. Where? This arrow you were talking mm -hmm. about? Oh, wow. And then there's another one right there. And down. Nice. Okay. That was a quick, easy one. Sleep. <laughs> you can't hide from the trees. We are everywhere. All right, that stash box is done. There's another one this way. Oh. Is there going to be more arrows or we just got to find it? No, we have to find the stash box and then from that stash box, it'll direct us to wherever the, um, the way to open it is. I'm going the right way. But you know what? Let me... I just want to go see. Make sure that there's, like, no lunchbox or anything over there. Mm-hmm. You think the lunchboxes might be done because of uh, what's her name? No. Was? No. Oh, okay. There's a whole bunch that we uh, missed. Oh, okay. Because they also give you tickets to power up your weapons. Oh, there's something right there. Yeah. You're talking about what just happened. They need to take this nigga off the air. Literally. Ha <laughs> 
<laughs> Get him off the air. Oh, um, Alan Walker. Oh my God, bro. Get this man off the air. Why don't you why don't you talk to somebody else? Why are you talking to the Is he old the only man with dementia? It gets worse each episode. Yeah. He is he like the only radio show in the area? Cause like, bro. Really? Every night was bingo night at the Valhalla nursing home. Each time Rose drew a ball from the cage and called out its number, some of the residents shouted bingo, no matter what was on their cards. Some of them sat mute, their cards full, never calling out. Some of them would try to steal the ball from her. Some of them would chastise the others for acting out. It was like herding a clouder of cats. Rose didn't mind. She liked cats. She knew she was where she was supposed to be, with her little Vikings waiting for the hero to come. Tonight, the residents were restless, more so than usual. Ati was wearing Blum's coveralls again. Tor stood by yep. the phone. Too late. Rose saw the hammer in his hand. The garden lights started to flicker, the darkness and rain pressing against the windows. The time drew nigh. It's it's funny because we're now we're reading the whole story of what just happened, the events that just happened. That was that mm -hmm. was that night, and she saw him with the hammer in his hand. Tor stood by the phone too late. Rose saw, yeah, Rose saw the hammer in his hand. Alan wrote that in, and then he wrote in waiting for the hero to come, and then that's why that's when Saga was like you know, when she talked to her and yeah. said what she said, and then she got hyped. Okay, so Alan was, well, both Scratch and Alan were using Rose. Yes. Okay, we got the page. Lunchbox. Oh, there There's we go. Didn't lunchbox. I tell you? Yeah, Didn't you I tell you? Don't pretend to be anyone or anything besides who you are. Where? I mean, I, I'm pretty sure that's everything, so I could probably go now. Oh, bro, hang on. Okay, yeah, no. You know what? I don't even need to do that. I don't even need to deal with y'all. So I'm just gonna go. I got everything that I need to get. You guys have a wonderful day. Lunchbox, stash box, Pat main radio station clip. Yeah, there was a lot of stuff hidden back there. I'm glad I turned around. Mm-hmm. be so loud I'm like let me just alert the whole force all right I'm right here all right let me do a manual save the 81st annual deer fest was just around the corner everyone in bright falls was bustling there were banners to be hung pies baked deer mass sold Bright Falls had made the top 100 American small town list for its modest rustic charm. The town expected a lot of tourists this year, but a shadow hung over the Deerfest preparations. The forecast promised rain. Fearful whispers promised more murders. The police were on high alert. Sheriff Breaker had deputies patrolling the streets at night. Bright Falls was no stranger to odd happenings, but to cancel Deerfest? Out of the question. The townsfolk were anxious, their anticipation mixed with fear. People had restless dreams. The lights seemed dimmer. Floodwater pressed in on the town. 
and the shadows poured in with it. Oh boy, bad things. The town expected a lot of tourists to see her, so Alan just brought a whole bunch of people into this mess. Mm -hmm. Let me save real quick again. Now we got that, and then try to use this mine place, mine place and see if it's fixed. Because if it's not, that is a problem. Okay, so is it just this that's f get the clicker to wake and make him fix his attempt to play God? That's the plan. But the FBC have him. Okay, no, it's working now. Yeah, that's different. Okay. Okay. Let's get back. Let's see. Yep, continue on the trail. Oh dear. <laughs> He's on the like Scooby too. <laughs> Wait, all right. Roll. roll. Oh boy. You're a fast Well, now there's less monsters. Oh, I see another. Okay, there we yeah. go. I was just about to say, I see another arrow. Oh, it's a passcode. Okay. Oh, now we need the third one. I mean, we could just use the two fudge that we... It. And just fudge it if I yeah. don't see it. Hang on. Okay, nope. I found it. Okay. The hourglass-shaped triangles... Mm -hmm. I just seen it. Right okay. There, the sideways. The sideways triangles. And then the third one was over here. Okay. All right. Hourglass. Oh. Hourglass. And then it was this, right? I didn't see the third one. But I think it was that. Okay. Hmm. Am I am I tripping? Nah, all right. Okay, so this one's first. So it's either the W. But where is this arrow pointing me to? The clouds. That's weird. That's why I'm confused. That arrow is pointing me somewhere. The double triangle, maybe? Nah. Okay. Okay. So let's try, try the W. But you just passed. Oh, I was doing it wrong. Was it this? Yeah. Oh, no, 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 no. No, it's overlapping. Okay, it's this one. Yeah, the W. The two triangles. Well, the hourglass. And then the two triangles. Yeah, it's that. Yeah, it's not. Okay. What other combination haven't we tried? We did this one. The hourglass first. Hourglass. W. T triangles W. And then this. Hourglass. 
Love you, and, and then, then that you. W hourglass. There no way, it was the very last one we tried. I, I want that flashbang, so something about to get dropped. Oh, I can use that. In We haven't found another one of those puzzles yet. With the thing on With the, the dolls. Yeah. yeah. I'm actually looking forward to another one of those. Mm -hmm. There's a ranger station. They're interesting. Oh, ranger station's right here. Wasn't there one here that we didn't figure out? Um, it's back at the other place. We have to go. Oh, we have to go the back. It's the, the other water. section. Yeah. Yeah. Nothing. All right. We got. We just gotta find the um. Key. Or. What the fuck? Must be locked from the other side. What is that? Okay. I think the stash box has the key to it. No, Lock doors. Oh. Oh, no. Screwdriver. Wait, what? I didn't even think about that. We have a screwdriver, right? Yeah. Because mm -hmm. we were using it to open okay. other doors. Okay. That bright light over yeah. there. Damn, this place like emptied out. Oh yeah, we never found the passcode. To the, to the other, other computer. computer. One, two, one. For later. What the hell? Nah, it just gave me something. Where was it? it the right there. Cold stash. Yeah. No, that wasn't what I just got. I think it's in the back, that one. Nursery rhymes, FBC files, yeah. listing test sites in Bright Falls. Ranger station, bunker woods, and bull yard. I think that's where all of it's just saying that's where all the nursery rhymes are. Maybe it's just letting me know. The passcode for this. I'm, I'm going to try that. Too. Oh, there is no passcode. Oh. Meaning, manning your stations. Dr. Campbell to Michael's Vega. Vega Michaels, Vega Michaels or Michaels Vega or yeah. Vega Air Michaels because it's a semicolon. Yeah, excuse me. It has come to my attention that both of you have left your posts on several occasions while on duty to gallivant around town on personal business. This is unacceptable. You are under strict FBC protocols regarding covertness and confidentiality. And as your supervisor, I am, I am responsible for your conduct at all times. If you find the work boring, too bad. You are to fulfill your roles and duties as i see fit and as the project requires i am changing your posts i'll be overseeing the watery area as it is now has the most test sites to cover the ranger cabin there will be my base of operations vega you are moving to cauldron lakes Witchfinder station michaels you are staying in the bright fall station i don't want to hear any excuses but i do need you to acknowledge these orders dr eugene campbell phd why, why lead researcher Department of Parafictional Research. It's kind of like when you're getting yelled at by your parent, and and the more hood or the more uh, uh, the more listen. patois comes out as they talk more. <laughs> Doctor Campbell acknowledged and understood. That goes for both of us, Michaels and me. It really was not gallivanting, as you put it, though. As I was attacked by some rabid animal out there in the woods, and Michaels helped me get medical attention in town. You should know all that if you read your messages, of course. Ooh. In any case, orders received. Damn, that was that. As per my last email, <laughs> I was attacked by a fucking dog, That's sir. Passive aggressive. <laughs> oh, oh man. Another rhyme. Oh, we okay. There is one in here. Okay. A child needs their mother to keep them safe and a home as their hiding place. Because outside the monsters roam and chase. When they ring your doorbell, don't yell. Don't tell them to go away. Give them treats and pray. They won't rock your house down to the ground. Okay. A child needs their mother to keep them safe. So mom? And a home is their hiding place. Mother doll. Okay, because outside the monsters roam and chase, when they ring your doorbell, don't yell. Don't tell them to go away. The monsters chase outside. Don't tell So the mother? Maybe the mother is on the heart? Mm. You, don't, you sure it's not the mother on the house? 
No, because it says the child needs the mother to, to keep, keep them, them safe, safe and a home as a hiding place. Oh, so the child and is, a home. As yeah. A, okay, so yeah, the child will go in the house. Don't tell them to go away. Give them treats and pray. Maybe the mom the goes candy. on the heart. Hang on. And the monster? Doesn't look right. Hmm. No, but I think it definitely has to do. I don't think the mom has it. The mom, the mother thing is throwing you off. It's three different. It's two different pieces. So a child needs their mother to keep them safe and a home is their hiding place. And then it says because the outside, because outside the monsters roam and chase. When they ring your doorbell, don't yell. Don't tell them to go away. Give them treats and pray. So a prayer doll. Over the treats. The, the prayer doll. What prayer I, doll? I didn't know it was a prayer. No, nah, we just don't have that doll it? yet. Let me get that because I do not have this doll. Let me see if. There's probably one upstairs. That's what makes the most sense. Whatever I mm -hmm. need for in here is probably up. Oh, look. They're all so soft and sad. Nothing in here. It's wild that it'll be like these big empty rooms. All for visual. Mm, oh, you mean them, these niggas wasted my time as I searched <laughs> Not through. even that. Just them, like, taking the time to make all of it for their, but for, for nothing to be there. But for the most part, it's all reused assets when you're, when you're talking about game development. it's This is the same exact room that we've been in a thousand times. That's true. I'm just like, damn, they couldn't put an ammo box in here at least? This shit is barren. Yeah, there's nothing in here. There's, like, a whole upstairs with nothing. Um, Did I... Yeah. Oh, yeah, I, that was the one that I took. And we did the computer. Right, the Maybe computer. back here. Let me just double check one more time. And then I'm going to look around outside to see if there's yeah, a doll. Yeah, I was going to say, too, we should probably check outside. You know what was weird? That dark present shit that was back there was kind of throwing me off. But we'll see. Nursery rhymes, dash box, let's go over here. You mean them being in the area? No, when I saw that stuff floating around, it's kind of like how mm. it told me to follow the footprints or whatever. Mm -hmm. All right, stash boxes over here. The stash boxes like right here. Okay. Another cult box. Let's see. Nope. They said you tried it. I still don't have a key. I keep seeing a, a, a bright ass light. Here it is. On the tree. No, it's just a lamp post. Oh, okay. I just want to see what's over here. Okay. Normally there's like a little lock box or something on those. I said not this time. Let me go back to it. I think there was something on the box that I didn't get a chance to look at. On the top of it. The clue. What? What is that? I don't know. I see deer. Yeah, I see deer. And then it's pointing at like a. a uh, it's like a. It's like a. A, a chimney. A guy it's on a top chimney. of a. Oh. It's like Santa. Oh shit! You're right. Deer. You're right. Okay. Can you crouch? Nah, and it would have popped up. But that was a good, that was a very good thought process, sure. Because I, I, like, I couldn't tell what I was looking at. Oh, what is it? A oh, doll. there it is. Look at that. Aren't we glad we came back here? Here it goes. Let's do it. Child doll. Monster doll. Sure. And I get my charm. And what did I, what did I just, what did I just get? I didn't see what I got. It, it flashed so quick. And I just heard like a doorbell. I think, I think I got a charm and it, it might've just went to the shoe box automatically. Unless I got a key and I didn't realize it. Hmm. Okay. Well, at least that's done. Another one of those rhymes. 
To the beach a child went wandering, pretty shiny rock she's gathering, but from the water a monster rose, a horrible beast with a pointy nose, a flapping wing and dragging toes. But the child was wrong, it was her mother all along, on a boat, grabbing a towel that's already gone. So the mom on the mom boat on and the, the boat. monster in the ocean. Or is the mother doll? Okay. Mother doll. The monster in the ocean. Nope. I was wrong. To the beach, a child went wandering. Pretty shiny rocks she's gathering. Maybe the mom in the ocean? I don't know. You're better at these ones. I, I, let I me thought see. it was pretty cut and dry, but clearly L not. Let me see if it's supposed to be a three-piece one. I think it might be three. What is this? I... I... I don't know. Is that the beach? Because <laughs> it looks like a ring. Yeah. Oh, yeah. there we go. Oh, shit. Okay, so I had the mom in the ocean, right? And the monster on the boat, right? What the oh, fuck? <laughs> Where are you going? Where are you going? Are you supposed to follow it? Uh oh, something else is coming. More monsters after that. I think. I thought I heard more behind you, but I guess not. Yeah. There goes the charm. Yeah, there's more. Get in your pajamas, bro. Ew. Running. <laughs> oh, it's in the puddle. Yeah, I know. <laughs> I went back in the puddle again. Punk ass nigga. Yeah, so, okay, so Shira, uh, why didn't we get a charm in the, I, I know I'm not tripping. It what, did you, did you click too quick or something? Do we gotta go do it again? In the one in there, did the charm just go somewhere? Like, or that's, because I like, that one summoned the monster and then I had to kill it to get the charm. Mm -hmm. That makes sense. We did that one in there and Is I didn't get the charm. this one supposed to summon the monster off of the roof? For the key? Mm -hmm. Or bring something to the roof. Hmm. Cause what are those? No, 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 no. Those are. Never mind. I keep forgetting that every last one of those is for a charm. But there's definitely something walking on the roof here. No, you know what that is? That's a nigga inside the house. That's what that is. Oh, upstairs. Yes. Okay, so we were not tripping. Oh yeah, look at the footsteps. FBI, open up! Ah. Uh. And he's pacing. Oh no. They just dropped it off.
Where'd it go? Oh, here it is. Coffee mug charm saves you from death, but shatters in the process. How they give you one freebie, basically. And I just want to let you know, you were absolutely correct about the chimney thing. We found the key. I picked it up. It was by the chimney. I don't know if you saw when I picked it up. No. Yeah, it was on the floor by the chimney. So let's go open that box. And then we can take a, a quick break. There it is. It took me forever to figure out the hint wasn't Santa's butt. Why are we making this so complicated? Just give us normal fucking keys, literally. <laughs> what I said earlier, how do we know it's not making it difficult for the cult members? <clears throat> All of that is done. Now we can just, what's this? Shoe box and painkillers. Go give him the clicker. Yeah, now we can mosey on back over. I'm glad we got to come back and do that stuff. Well, that's this not you're you're confusing it. That's not the area where we had to. No, come I back know to the it. water. Yeah. I know, but I'm just saying I'm glad we got to come back and do the stuff here, and then we got to go back over there and do the stuff over there. So are you going there first? Or are you going to go do? Um, we'll see. It just depends on how the story beat goes. Oh yeah, there's one more right there. In this area? Yeah, so let's go get that. You know what? What the fuck? I don't like that. I just do that. Cold stash right over here. Why does it keep doing that every time I'm, I'm I don't in this? know. Bike, car. There are 200 total vehicles in a factory consisting of bicycles and cars. Each car has four wheels oh and each God. bicycle has two wheels. There are a total of 754 wheels in the factory. How many cars are in the factory? Okay, 200 total vehicles. It's just bikes and cars. A car has four wheels, a bike has two wheels. There are a total of 754 wheels in the factory. How many cars? Okay, let's do some quick math. Because if I do 200 divided oh, by... Four. four that's 50 and then 50 into 754 just try it four. no it's a three number it's three numbers yeah hmm johnny has two apples <laughs> We need we need to know how many cars are in there. There are two hundred. It's a it's vehicles. in the yeah it's in the it's in the it's in the three digit range. The wheels shouldn't matter. Seven fifty four divided by four is okay. One eighty eight seven fifty four. <laughs> Fuck! I hate math, bro. You're better at math than I am. Hang on, am, let me though. see. Each car has four wheels. Because it could have been one hundred and eighty eight, and there could have just been one bicycle in there. Let me see if they just fucking with me. Okay, no, they really want me to solve this math problem. Yo, the prize for this better be fucking epic. Is it epic. zero one two? What? Try zero one two. Twelve? Yeah. Twelve cars? All right, I think I figured it out. Here we go. My brain just clicked out of nowhere. Okay, hang on. <laughs> Oh, no, 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 wrong thing. Whoops, I put in the wrong thing. There we go. How in the world did you get 177? Okay, because it's very simple. I'm explaining for y'all in the chat too because it took a minute for my brain to click. All right, there's 200 total vehicles uh -huh. in the facility, yes. but a total of 754 wheels. Uh -huh. So if we just simply do four times 200, let's say they were all cars, four uh -huh. times 200, that's 800 wheels, that's uh -huh. too many. Okay. So 800 minus 754, that gives you that, whatever that difference was, which was, okay. So 800 wheels is too many. We need to get to 754. 800 minus 754 is 46. Uh -huh. That's 46 wheels. 46 wheels divided by two is 23 bikes. So 23 bikes gives me 46 wheels. And that's the difference between 874. So I just subtract the 23 from the 200 vehicles and I get 177. That makes sense. Okay. I think that's what my brain was trying to do, but just couldn't oh, figure out. about me, man. I just couldn't figure out. I told you you're better at math than I am. Give me a paper. I'll write you an 18 paragraph ace. 
18 page yeah, essay. Yeah, you can write for days. I hate that shit. <laughs> but I like, I, I hate math, but I like problem solving. Isn't Give that funny? Give me a 20 page dissertation. And, well, I can't, I can't stay in math. So wait, did we get? Oh, sure. I think actually, I think we did do everything over here. You're right. Okay. No way. Because I was like, I thought that. Nah, there's, a there's still there's still a stash, stash box stash. up there. But I could have sworn this was the area where we was missing a lot, most of the stuff, like where we didn't have the key to open the boxes. But but no, because what the, the hell? Swamp. There was there. Remember the place where we couldn't the figure flooded? out the, the flooded area where we couldn't figure out the passcode to the computer. What about that? Hang on, let's go to this boat yard. There's another nursery rhyme in the boat yard. But wasn't that in the trailer park? It was. Yeah. No. Are you sure? Yeah, it was in one of those ranger stations. Because that's what... Okay. I think. Because I remember we were trying to figure out stuff with the emails and whose house was going to whose house. Oh, you know what? You know what? Hang on, wait. Where's the... Where's the trailer park? Yeah, see, the trailer park isn't even here. What the hell? That's why. Okay, we need to... Yes, it's not the same place. I got to go to Cauldron Lake. Yes. Cauldron so right now we're in the Bright Falls Woods. We need... stuff too. Yes, Cauldron okay. Lake is yeah. where we have to go back to. Yeah. All right. That's correct. All I remember, there was two areas we couldn't unlock boxes. <laughs> yeah. That's all I remembered. All right, let me put these bolt cutters to use, baby. What's I up? I think there's another puzzle as well that we have to solve that we didn't get to solve on the ground. Up oh, passcode. A five five five. Five 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 five. Oh wait, nope, never mind. Saga just breaking and entering all over all over the area. Nursery rhyme. There's a rhyme over here. All right, let's see. Five little monsters out on the sea, competing to see who the winner will be. They rocked their boats to find out who floats until one little monster did fall. Mama called out to the sea and cried, and the sea, she replied, on the bottom they will rot if they will not stop rocking their boats. And they go, what? Okay, try a monster on uh, the boat and the mom in the sea. Okay, okay. okay. There you go, Shira. There you go, Shira. You're cooking now. All right. Where is this leading us to? There's gonna be five of them that I gotta fight. Yeah, they're running. Five monsters on the sea. Three. Was that three or was that four? That was three. Okay, I think that it's like, what is this, like hide and seek? Four. Oh. Yeah, was, that was five. That's weird. I counted four. Because one of them took two shots. Oh, I need that. I need uh, that right now. I just somehow missed one that you uh, killed. What is that stick? It's a flare, but I don't really use these. You just drop it and grab the other thing. You just drop it. We don't need it. Oh, wow. I can't discard it. Weird. Um, what about the other flares? All right, I'm just gonna have to drop a a health pack. Okay, that works. All right, where's the? 
Thank you. There we go. Bruh. I said you have too many keychains. See? No. Chance to stun enemy on flashlight boost. Alright. Let's just get back and find a safe spot. Yeah, there we go. There was a shortcut back to town. Look at Ati out here mm -hmm. mopping the street. And that is just gonna be dirty regardless of what. There we go. Okay, in here. All right, let's get everything that's in here. A locked door, manuscript page, just a cold stash in the back. I need to go to the right. She's been there since like like yeah. hours ago. Hello. Hmm, that probably opens up later. So what was the other thing in here? The manuscript page. It looks like it was in here. Did I miss this forever ago? Or is this new? Let's see. Ed hadn't been the same since his latest show had closed. This wasn't the first time one of his productions had shuttered early. Scathing social commentary in a one-act play wasn't exactly filling seats. When Tammy told him she was taking a research trip to Bright Falls, he decided to tag along. Ed told her he wanted to find inspiration. Really, he just wanted a break from the city. But it was true that he certainly needed to find something. A voice, a direction, an idea something authentic to himself ed knew he couldn't keep using tammy's money to fund his playwriting and that was a guy that was writing the plane the hotel the from the tammy, last one. ed stormed out of the diner and drove their rental car back to cauldron lake to prove a point now standing in the dark woods the sun hidden by the trees ed wished he could remember what that point was yeah something about masculinity he cursed at himself and turned to go suddenly he was blinded by a light in his face Voices shouted and hands pushed him to the ground. Ed struggled in vain. That's crazy. You went there to argue and then you got bodied. <laughs> it wasn't worth it. Who are you to say what was worth it, Shira? You don't know him. Wasn't even worth it. Didn't even remember what he went there to argue about. Something about masculin masculinity that is funny the whole situation but he was also written in the story to forget so that's why he forgot why the f he even went there we're missing four dolls okay i wonder if we're gonna figure out what her deal is Guess there's something in there she really need. I mean, there might be something in there that you need, but there's nobody in there. Yeah, I don't know. She clearly thinks so. All right, there's a cult stash box. Looks like. What the hell? I walked right by it? Where is it? Oh, right here. Another locked box. Oh shit, hang on. Nice. Fear the dark, fear the woods. 
Oh, damn. Sure. I forgot one of the main things I had to do in there was put some stuff in the shoebox so that I have room in the inventory. Oh, because we're full. Where is it at? Right there. Wasn't there one more? Um, no. I thought I saw one more. Trauma pad. All right, cauldron leak. Um, there was like two more things over there. Oh, okay. And then we'll head back to the cauldron leak and see what's up. The people just burst in here and expect others to clean up after them. Okay, it's to the back of this building. Bolt cutters, I need that. Okay, go around this building and then the building to right next to it also. There's another cult stash. Work log. First of January. Overprivileged town folks complaining about poor TV reception. Hopefully not due to the paint job. 17th of January. Took a photo with the giant moose statue in the park. Great memento. 2nd of February. Damn dogs keep digging in the flowers. Park's trash can needed a fresh coat of paint. Painted an extra layer. Tried painting the large tree in the park, but the weather was too hot. Cooled down on a bench in the sheltered area and had an epiphany. March. Replaced a screw on the purple park bench. Okay. So town hall folk complaining about poor TV reception. So maybe the combination has something to do with the dates. It's the paint. The paint is the consistent thing. So TV reception not due to the paint job. Took a photo with a giant moose statue in the park. Park's trash can needed a fresh coat of paint. That's Painted the an extra one. layer. And Tra then number three is March third. But that's there's only three. Total. Purple park bench. Purple park bench. Giant moose statue. And TV, hang on. Because the purple park bench, they replaced the screw. They didn't paint it. Okay, let's see. All right, first let's see if there's one on the giant moose statue. Where is that? Um, isn't it like when you first? Over here. Over here. Oh wait, no. This no, is those like are a... deer. I remember seeing it in the... I feel like I've seen it, or am I just confusing? I think the, only, the last time we seen a giant moose statue was the moose mask. Maybe it's, like, over there. All right. I feel like it wouldn't be so, so far. Same. I mean, there's a purple park bench, so we can check that. Yeah. The sacrifice oh, there's a, a, a The pain It's happening again. Okay, so the co is the cold those things again? Hmm. I think is that supposed to be the we park bench? The last time, didn't we? I'm I'm just I'm trying to figure that out myself. Yeah, there's nothing here. Screwdriver and locked door. Oh dear, diner. Oh, it's just a pin. Okay. All right, so we saw two triangles on top of each other, and then yeah. Um, then two triangles it was to the side each other. and overlapping triangles. And then the third one, we can, if they don't see it, then we can just finagle it. But the only problem is finagling it, it gets rough. We don't rough, know which order. Well, we don't know the order. Well, that one's first, I think. Up there. Where? Oh, wait, no, that's the lamppost. That's yellow. Let's go play with it a little bit. I have faith in our finagling. Let's try the two symbols we know first. Yeah, if they are even the symbols. If it's numbers, then it's something to do with it. Okay. okay, yeah. So the two triangles on top of each other, right there. It was, the first one is this, and then it was this. Are you sure the first one's that? Yep. I thought it was like, they were both up, pointing up. No, it was like uh, uh, against each other, like that. So we seen these two. Okay, well let's keep clicking the third. I did. 
Oh, okay. Or swap them and then click the third. Okay, cool down on a bench in the sheltered area and had a pi an epiphany that okay, I can so paint the it right there. Sheltered area, we saw that. That's the one we got. Parks trash can needed a fresh coat of paint. So the trash can, the flowers, and under the bench. Oh, giant moose statues in the park. It literally said it right there. I just didn't see it. So we just need a giant moose statue, the sheltered area. I think the moose statue one is first. I think it's in order on the list of the paper. Let me see this one again. Okay, yeah. Okay. I mean, it could be the up and down triangles. That's what I was. I, that's what I'm I thought sure it was. Whatever is coming is I thought it was the up down okay. one, not the sideways. It's probably the up down one. Do you see a moose statue? No, I do not. Took a picture with the giant moose statue in the park. What's that over there? Turn to the left. Oh, wait. And then he said he tried to paint one by this tree, but then had an epiphany when he sat down on the sheltered bench. I'm just making we sure. We got the one by the bench. Mm. Yeah. He sat on the bench up front. No, he sat on the bench in the sheltered area. He said that's the sheltered area back there. That's why there's oh, okay. one back there. Yeah, I don't, I don't see the moose statue. There, there is no moose statue. Wait, turn around, look up. I'm um, just trying to make sure I don't just see it anywhere. Okay, no, I do not. All right, let's go back to the puzzle. I think we can figure it out. I think the issue is the up down arrow. I don't think it's side to side. I think it's up down. Yeah, you're probably right. And I think the order is the order on the paper. Okay, so damn dogs keep digging up the flowers, so. So, okay, so this one's the last one. That's the last one. Mm -hmm. Okay, let's or try to flip it. What the hell? Maybe try the middle. I I guess. Let's try switching these two. Just in case. Mm-hmm. Right there. There you go. Uh, yeah. That's crazy. Overprivileged. Is, is it maybe the the by the TV? Yeah, he did some kind of TV paint job in the town hall. But I feel like the third symbol should be in the park. The first two are in the park. In the park. Why is the third one not in the park? You know? Yeah, it's it's weird. Okay, you know what? I'm just going to do this, and then we're just going to continue, because I'm, I'm, I'm not going to drive myself mad over that. Okay. It's probably some bullshit in there anyway. One of us okay. needs to stay at the lodge in case Marcy shows up. And the other one should go out looking for Dear Diary, Alan contacted me again today. This is Rose. There was a message for me hidden in the newspaper. He wanted to make sure I was ready for his arrival. What a silly thing to even ask. Of course I'm ready. Duh, Alan. Oh, and Norman got into the dried apricots at work again. I swear we'll have to fumigate the place. Dear Diary, some guy at the diner got mad that I brought him a piece of cherry pie and demanded a free piece of apple pie, but he totally ordered cherry. And when I pointed out that he already took like two bites of the cherry, he said he thought it was apple. Apple pie and cherry pie do not look the same. Damn, slow news day. I could, I told him he could order another piece, but he'd have to pay for it. And he got so mad and started screaming about leaving me a bad review. Like, I care about reviews. 
Anyway, I <laughs> took away his pie and told him baby shouldn't be eating sweets. He shouted a bit and then left. Some people. Dear diary, Cynthia has been acting up lately. I think she's turning into a you know what. Lots of you know what's oh taken. Mm -hmm. Lots of new you know what's popping up lately. I'll keep an eye on it. If things get out of hand, I can always get out the rifle. I'm sure Alan would appreciate me keeping the place safe. She said she was about to bat yeah. this lady. If things get out of hand, I'll just shoot her. That's cool. And then there's one other there's another locked door over here. Damn, that was it in here? There's no key or anything? No? 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 Okay. And they're off. Alright, I wish I could. Can I move the map? No, I literally have to go down there. Cauldron Lake. Let's see what we missed. Didn't even go over there. That shit's far. All right, let's go straight ahead to the rental cabins. This should be quick, said the fool. Oh, wait. Is this blocked? Yeah. Bolt cutters. Oh, fresh. Location to explore. Okay. All right, nothing in this rental cabin. It's got messed up in there. Okay, that sounded like a frog, but then it also sounded not no, like a frog. So yeah. I think it's a frog, like you said. Or or like a radio. Yeah, or a radio. Yeah, it's, yeah, a, it's radio. a radio. Oh, it's blocked. Alright, they wouldn't let me. Another rhyme. And then it stopped. Yeah. Well, first, let me see if there's a doll in here. Birds, watching you like in that movie, but protective, not attacking. Mythical inspiration, guardian spirits, Norse mythology, or ancient Egyptian. Corvus Corax from the family Corvidae. Research, symbolism, and uses. Elements, stalking monster, watchful birds. Stakes can't be too high for both risk management and fruitful outcomes. Make sure the rhyming is looser this time. Need to test this approach for possibly more ambiguous interpretational results. They were going ham with these nursery mm. rhymes trying to test them out. Our hero, courageous and true, stalked by the monster hatching through. The clever crows call their warning and keep an eye on the battle forming. When the fight is done and over, the hero and the crows reap the rewards, reap the rewards left for her. Okay. So a crow in the eye and then a hero. Stalked by the monster hatching through. Yeah. And keep an eye on the battle forming when the fight is done. The hero and the crows reap the rewards. Okay. That's what I would have guessed. Yeah, there you go. yeah. Because the monsters are ha the, the hatching. The monster hatching through. Where is it leading me? There's some. Oh, never mind. Those are up now. I don't see nothing. Neither do I. Maybe out here because the music. Oh, shit. We will watch. Yeah, you will watch nothing, sir. Maybe in there where he came out of? Yeah, there it is. A charm. Saves you from death, but shadows in the... Ah, uh, another one of those. 
You should put it in the shoe box. Yep, that's exactly where it's going. Bright Falls Record Cauldron Lake closed. Is your email hacker proof? Too many people, hackers are the stuff of Hollywood movies and TV shows. Dark criminals committing cyber crimes in action movies. But too many people around the world, hackers are a very real threat. Cyber crime experts warn that phishing attempts are on the rise and show little sign of stopping. What is phishing, you may be asking yourself. Phishing is when someone poses as a fake email address in order to trick the recipient into sharing their personal information. Information which could then be used to access bank accounts or other personal databases. Even the most professional looking emails or text messages can be faked. Experts warn so people are encouraged to always act with caution when sharing information on the net. All it takes is one mistake and your information could be out there forever. Bright Falls Bookstore Raffle Bonanza. Anyone looking for a gift for the reader in their life would do well to visit Bright Falls Bookstore this weekend. In an effort to clear out the stock room, Bright Falls Bookstore is raffling off hundreds of old books and collections, including many signed books and items considered collector's editions. All proceeds will go towards renovating the bookstore and charitable donations to student literacy programs. Tickets for the raffle will be on sale from 9 a.m. on Saturday until 6 p.m. the following day, with drawing taking place Monday morning. Oh, shit. Who got evicted? Eviction notice effective immediately. The Federal Bureau of Control has designated this area to be vacated as a matter of public health and safety. Failure to comply with this order is a federal crime and res will result in swift and forceful action per code 0157-DE. Your compliance is appreciated. That's crazy. So they kicked them out so they can conduct their experiments. their experiments hi there little friend where's the stash box wasn't it at the rental cabins? It, this is the rental cabins. I'm oh. just trying to figure out where. Oh, behind me. That way. Okay, I have to go through the back. So this one. Mm -hmm. <sighs> Another one of those lunch boxes. Nice. His hair was longer than I remembered, blowing gently into the cool night breeze. I put my hands to his cheek to confirm that he was indeed real, and he was. He was real, feeling his handsome beard wild but neatly trimmed. Beneath my fingers proved it. You're back, I breathed. Yes, I'm back. I wasn't cold any longer. Yeah, her story that she was writing, that she said mm -hmm. I'd made it into the lunch boxes. Mm. What? Of course. Day one, some weird animal tried to break into our clubhouse. It was scary. It hit it off a big stick and it ran away. I think it was a squirrel before. Day three, our candy stash has gone missing. Maybe it was a squirrel. Day six, Max found candy wrappers in the woods. Oh there God. was some big poops there. It wasn't the squirrel. Day seven, Max has gone missing. We're not even <laughs> in the south, sure. <laughs> 
But that's how it's spelled. Beware the wicked witch rules. One person is the wicked witch. Two, everybody else has to run and hide. Three, when the witch says, beware me, everybody has to change places. Four, if you go to someone else's hiding place, you can tag them to kill them. Five, don't get tagged and killed. Six, if the witch, wicked witch finds you, you're dead. Seven, if you find the, wick, the witch's lair, she is caught. Eight, burn the witch. kids in their games all right this shit should be okay i was like y'all driving me nuts where is the box where is oh it's a save room animals stayed away from the water's edge as if to avoid some unseen submerged predator waiting just below the dark surface they never drank the water from the lake birds flew around it never over darkness flowed from cauldron lake gaze in the black mirror of the lake you'd see it all around you and you'd understand it was already out, already where you were. It was already too late. Cauldron Lake used to be alive with people. Beautiful forests, hiking trails leading to stunning vistas. Then the government put up a fence, kept the people out. Volcanic gas, they said. They didn't want anyone knowing the truth. The lake wasn't a lake at all. The dark water a mask to hide the hungry, bottomless ocean below. A fence couldn't stop the flood that was coming. Nothing could. The return of the nightmare rising from the depths. The return of the nightmare rising from the depths. He kept that part. Return. Put up a fence. Okay, it's the black mirror on the lake. You see, uh, man, uh, this shit is nuts. The way that they're mm -hmm. working to craft this story. This cold stash was in the street, literally just out in the street. That's funny. Okay, yeah, the rest of them we can't do yet. Another one of those cult boxes. What? Which one's one? I see two, I see three. Okay, so I think it's just saying this is the flow of things. Tornado. Mm -hmm. Tornado. Tornado, the castle, the bridge. So looking through the window. Tornado, the castle, the bridge, the volcano, or whatever that is. Or the mountain. Bridge. Is all that stuff in here? House. Tree. All that stuff has to be out here. It's definitely like some kind of trail or path. Let me look at that one more time. Cause this is the this is one of the wildest ones yet. Cause that's yeah, a key. Yeah, past the tiny, past the tornado. Through. Window, window, tornado, castle. Bridge. Mountain, house. Bone graveyard tree. What is that? Oh, it's niggas. That's what it is. Yeah. I was talking about a coffee machine. And yeah, I heard He coffee. was an employee from the Federal Bureau of Control. I could see his mm -hmm. jacket. All right, so that stash box is going to just stay where the fuck it's at because that, I, I, yeah. Locked. 
the door. Janitor's closet. You know what? I'm just gonna continue on with the story. That's what I'm gonna do. Cause these stash boxes are gonna drive me insane. Did we ever figure out the one where it was like a circle and we needed a key cause it was a bunch of arrows and they were all just like in a circle. Is that the last one we did? I remember we kept going round and round and round and looking for the key on the path. Oh yeah, yeah, we did that. Okay, I was just making sure. All right, let's go back to bright fall. That other one is a problem in the park. Uh, because yeah. he said there's a deer statue or a moose statue or moose. whatever, and there's nothing in there. All right, let's go to the sheriff station. Oh boy. Power's oh, out. Shit. Always a good sign. Undiscovered map. Oh, you mean that map? Anyone here? I'm here in the closet. Agent what Estevez? The hell? Is that you? Anderson? Oh, remember me? Did I tell you to fuck off? Yeah, you did. Looks like it's a good thing I didn't. <sighs> Looks like. <laughs> My leg's busted, so I'm gonna need your help. Listen, there is a person out there with you invaded by something that we call the shadow, and if you a don't. Taken. Yeah, I'll handle it. Stupid. I guess we just follow the trail of fucking bodies. Yeah. There's Taken inside. I think we read this. Yeah. Yeah. The toilet the paper. The toilet paper rolls. Holding cells. Is that where they're keeping Wake? Door is locked, though. What happened here? The cult taken, wake is the priority. You get that door open. They must not know about me, Shira. They must not know. You must not know about me. All clear, Estevez. I am Saga Wick. Yeah, Saga Wick. So you think I'm not? I didn't say so. I just was laughing That at the leg game. doesn't look good. <sighs> Feels even worse. But thanks for saving the rest of me. We should talk. What happened here? <laughs> Where to fucking start? Uh, we came to check out a system alert at Cauldron Lake, but it's worse than we could handle. Real boondoggle. The police, my own agents, most were invaded before we could even react. Have you found my partner, Agent Casey? Yeah, we found him. Out in the woods. He had a close encounter with the shadow, and it did something to him. Oh, Is he boy. okay? He's alive. We took him down to the morgue for an examination. Haven't heard anything since the attack. What did the FBC come here to do? Bright Falls is the site of a recurring altered world event. The shadow is stronger than we expected. We're low on resources, problems at HQ. But we do have equipment for dealing with the shaded threat. We were just caught off guard before we could set it up. Where is Wake? I know what's going on here. Wake can fix this. Alan Wake is a para-utilitarian. The word's a mouthful, so you know it's serious. We have him locked up in the holding cells per protocol. He's connected to the shadow in some way. Estevez, mm. I need to see Wake. How do I get into the cell block? Okay. <laughs> Protocols don't mean that much at this point anyway. Uh, literally. Don't make me regret this, Anderson. 
Until the power's back on, the door to the holding cells won't open. There's a fuse box downstairs in the basement. Here. Thank you, ma'am. I need these keys. Yep. Cough them I up. got the keys, keys, keys. All right, so those are the keys to that door we'll right there. Way. Back into the morgue, huh? Oh, boy, the whole game started. Yeah. The cell door won't open without power. Awesome. I'm sure there's what it, oh, do we just have just the one monster? There's gonna be some more monsters along the way. Uh, oh, you think it's no, done? She literally said there's take it in there. It's oh, over. Okay. Oh yeah, I hear them. Ooh. Regarding Alan Wake and cult connection, summary. In 2010, writer and suspected paratilitarian Alan Wake was reported to have disappeared into Cauldron Lake, a known threshold site. Three years later, a small group responsible for multiple killings was arrested in New York City by federal investigators. The murderers were recreations of deaths found in the writing of Alan Wake. Interrogations with the murderers revealed they saw Wake as a sort of prophet, describing themselves as his cult, and, and considered his novels to be sacred texts. As Wake was missing at the time, it's unlikely he had any personal involvement with this cult. At least there is no evidence supporting the idea. Idea. Soon after the New York cult was detained, an organization known as the Cult of the Tree began operating around Cauldron Lake, the same area Wake disappeared. This is now the second organization branding themselves as a cult with a direct physical connection to Alan Wake, operating in the location he was last seen in. I propose this is not a coincidence and would like permission to search for a link between Wake and the Cult of the Tree. Research facility WA03 at Cauldron Lake, Washington has been compromised, cause unknown. The incident was visually confirmed by Agent Estevez when she visited the facility to make contact with Dr. Marmont and Dr. Marmont heads of operations at the Lake House. The facility itself is reported to be in damaged state with no living staff around during a brief search. A longer search was not possible due to an active AWE in the area requiring all available resources. Investigation and containment not possible with current personnel. Emergency dispatch of response and rescue staff is requested. The investigation department has no knowledge of the Lake House's recent research or projects due to worsening communications and cooperation since HQ went dark. As a result, this report cannot determine the incident's cause without further investigation. Refer to line 92333215 for full incident report. I think this goes here. No? FBC file linking cult activity to wake. Cult psychology. Keep trying. No, that's done. It was a cult psychology. Right. It's possible Wake is connected to the cult, but if Scratch is identical to Wake, then this could refer to either of them. Correct, which is what we've been saying since the start mm -hmm. of the game. Memory loss. The battle to regain your mind. Author L. Temp. Don't forget ABC123. Mm. IJKL9123. Nine zero one two. What? Hang on. A is one, B is two, C is three, I is nine, J is zero, K is one, L is two. Okay. So, all right. This passcode is around here. This is for the lock. Mm hmm. Oh, wow, they have pictures, the picture of Warland Door. I see it. I noticed all that noise is making me so uncomfortable. Yeah, I know. <laughs> I thought I saw something. It sounds more. like they eating some, like, bus and ramen in there. Yeah, they're just slurping it down. All right. Oh, 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 oh. I get it. I get it. I get it. I think it has to do with the name, the authors. And B. Like Batson. Two. There's no C, though. Or J. These books have to be... Okay, hang on. Batson Quincy Westmore. Mm -hmm. 
This is the passcode. WBQ. Oh, okay, okay, okay. WBQ. What letter, what number letter of the alphabet is W? So it's, oh shit, that actually does not, that actually does not help. Never mind. Shit. Cause it's basically letting you know, oh wait, no. L also equals two? Never mind, never mind. As I said, no, mm, 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 Cause J is zero. Oh, it starts over, it starts over. Okay, K, L, M, but where's N, eight? O, P, Q, R, S, oh, okay. H U, V, e, W. Three, two. The first number is three. The second number is two. J that would be three, four, five, six. K okay, I understand L -M -N -O -P -Q So all we have to really know is A through I is nine. Three, two, seven. Wait, where are you getting three, two, seven? Okay, because look, right here, I'm pretty sure the passcode is WBQ, right? It, the numbers go one to nine, and then it goes to zero uh -huh. after J. J is after I. Nine is the last number, then it goes to so zero. So then maybe seven, two, three. Kay. So K, L, M, N, O, P, Q, that's seven. Q is seven. Uh-huh. R, S, T, U, V, W. Three, three, two, seven is what I would get. That's why I said it might be transpose seven, two, three. There you mm -hmm. go. Of course. Damn, son. Okay, well y'all gotta give me a y'all gotta give me a room to put this in. Get the power working in the basement. Maybe if I could get to the basement. All right, here we go. Do you read me, Anderson? I read you. Have you had our frequency this entire time? Eavesdropping is a big part of the job. Wow. But no, I got it from your partner. Anderson, look for a fuse to replace the blown out one in the fuse box. That should get the power going again. Yeah. On it. Another cold stash? In the sheriff's office? What is that? One. One, two, three, four. One, two. One, four, six. Nice. Beware the coal of the tree. Maxed out on the flashbangs. All right, they can fuck around. They're gonna find out. Oh wait, nice shoebox in here. Don't see. Oh, right there. I mean, you could. I don't be needing all of that. the keychain yeah all right let's see if i have room for that shotgun i you probably I, gotta move those two up and it could fit above the current one that these two you probably move it up yeah and then it'll probably fit okay cool saved Go back upstairs real quick and grab that because it's a it's a new shotgun. Mm -hmm. It's a stronger shotgun. They say you gonna need it. I'm sure Sheriff Breaker wouldn't mind me borrowing this. Not at all. Oh, I got every weapon in the game. Nice. And this shit holds six rounds. Let's go. They still fighting back. Violence. Yo, they're giving me a lot of. Hang on. Quick slot this there. Quick 
quick slot this. Yeah. What, ammo? Yeah, they're giving me a lot of flares and shit. Casey! Ooh. Is that you? Anderson? Hold your fire! I'm coming in! Well, first, let's... And they said something's wrong with him. Okay, nothing's in here. Yeah, look how much flares are giving me. Yo, relax. Check on Casey. Yeah, because they said something's wrong with him. Yeah, he was in here. Description of injury. Subject seems physically weakened with some confusion about his whereabouts and events. Concussion. Similar symptoms to those becoming shaded individuals. Exposure to the shadow is suspected but not confirmed. Physical wounds are minimal. Light abrasions. Possible mild concussion. Continued observation shows no signs of increased aggression in subject. Subject remains aware and coherent. A starkly different progression than other victims. Reasons for exceptional result unknown. Less severe exposure. Subject's resilience. Intentionality on shadow's part requires further examination. Because he was written into the story. Yeah. Oh, there he goes. Hey, Anderson. Like what I've done with the place? Hmm. Could use a bit more Goliath. <sighs> Funny. Yeah, I could use a bit more Goliath. How are you holding up? Ah, don't give me that worried look, Anderson. It's just a, it's a flesh wound. <laughs> Gave me a chance to have a... A nice chat about ex-wives with uh, Kieran. Uh, Agent Estevez, I mean. Making new friends, huh? I'm jealous. Are you sure you're okay? Yeah, I'm fine. Oh, what the? What's the up? Oh, we can read situation his thoughts. Yep, friend? we're gonna profile him. What happened back at the hotel? What happened at the hotel? Wake was telling the truth about the cult being after him. The thing, the dark presence, it's real too. I saw it, a fucked up monster cloud. Wake tried to warn me, it knocked me out. FBC found me in the woods later. Before that, you about to get profiled my boy. This is probably gonna open up um, a lot more dialogue. I can tell something is wrong. What's happening to Casey? I'm a goner. Swell. A shadow crawling under my skin. In my head. Call my ex. Tell her I'm sorry. Damn. Terminal case, Casey. Something is wrong with him. He's hurt worse than he says. He's scared. All right, bro. Yeah, something Watery is turned out to be a good lead. Him. Found the clicker and the cult. But the horror story is changing reality. Like Wake said it would. Logan, she's uh. The story claims she died here. But we can stop it. Wait, Saga. What are you um? Logan is gone. She has been. Oh, for God. a long time. Casey's affected by the horror yep. story, too. Mm -hmm. I'm fighting for them all now. I'm gonna fix this, Casey. You, Logan, all of it. I just need to get the power back on first. Yeah, give him hell, Anderson. Just remember. Some things in life can't be fixed with a light switch. As for the power problem, here. I found a fuse on those poor bastards there. Oh, thank you. I'll take this care of it. This is the work. Stay put, Casey. Of looking for I'll let one. you know when it's safe. I'm not going anywhere. Yeah, nigga, you couldn't just put the fucking fuse back in there, Alex. They was coming Anderson. out. I'm looking them dead on Good the floor. News. Bad news. You can get to the cell block now, but the shaded hostels that were in there are on the loose. Thanks for the heads up. 
awesome. Listen, y'all could come at me if you want. You about to get blasted. I didn't even get to shoot the weak spot on that one. Okay. Okay. You know what? You got me. More coming down. Might want to do it twice. <laughs> Nigga, damn. How could it escape its gravity? Hurry up. Just took mad health from me, bro. If it just waltzed its way up on in here, uh, it's waiting. Yeah, yeah, it could wait. Mm. Oh. I don't think it's gonna let you attack it while you're in here. Are you serious? It's a ceasefire. It won't let me go. I just run through it. You can't run through I it? I can't. I'm trying. There you go. Top 100 America! Thank you. Oh my gosh. Situation is under control, Estevez. Coming back up. Copy. I do love how the game almost soft locked me into that area, though. That was scary. You know, that's safe. Got a little cramped in that closet. What's going on? We had a hell of a time avoiding those taken. Ended up back here. Anyway, I wanted to warn you that we have the Coscula brothers in the cells as well. They're the ringleaders of the cult of the tree. Don't let your guard down. Is the FBC sending any help? <sighs> we were the help. Well, us in the lake house. But we still have bureau gear specifically engineered to fight this threat. It's stored in the back lot. We were setting it up when the Taken interrupted us. We have light arrays, a containment cell, etc., etc. We are not out of this fight yet. What's at the lake house? It's a bureau research facility at Cauldron Lake set up to study the effects of this AWE. When I got into town, I went there for backup. The whole station is lost, taken by the shadow. Lost a lot of agents. Barely got out myself. Wish me luck. According to the Luck and Probability Department, it's statistically bad luck to wish people good luck during a crisis. Yeah, Thanks. the Luck and Probability Department? They have a department for that? And that's funny. Yeah, I probably should wish you good luck because it's bad luck to wish you good luck in a bad situation. We read those. Saga. Fucking FBI, FBC, you government fucks all fucking this up for us. Let us the fuck out. You're the leaders of the cult. You're not going anywhere. 
Wake will ruin everything. Get rid of him, Saga. You fucking shot me. Typical government stooge. Let me out so I can kill him. That fucker. Let us the fuck out. Yeah. You come to our town and act like you know what you're dealing with, but you have no fucking idea. Let us. Agent Hush. Young held his clipboard up to the light. The equipment was all accounted for. He ticked the boxes, satisfied. A noise on the other side of the back lot made him pause. He peered into the darkness. Nothing. Shrugging, he signed and dated the form. Estevez wanted everything ready, just in case. Young appreciated a cautious leader. Estevez had held it together even after the oldest house had gone dark. Young began to head inside. The local sheriff's station was a tight fit, but at least they had a coffee machine. Young felt optimistic. They even had the pair utilitarian in custody already. Another clatter behind him. Closer this time. He turned, hand on his holster. Up. He called out to the darkness. Clapped. This station has been seized by the Federal Bureau of Control. You're not authorized to be here. Suddenly, the lights flickered, went off. Young couldn't see a thing. Then from inside the station, the screams began. Damn. So, oh, Alan wrote himself to be captured because it said the para the para utilitarian was already in custody. Mm -hmm. Hang on, real quick. Well, it was either he got captured or he got clapped. Um, Saka, deputy corrupted, Costco's parade float. Which one was it that he got taken? In the shootout? Is that what you're talking about? After yeah. the shootout, wherever that was. Oh, here we go. The cult storms the lodge. Mm hmm. That. And see, so he um, didn't any edit. Well, I think this is before the writing got taken. Oh, over. no. This hasn't happened yet. Oh, okay. Okay, yeah, because we're in. Scra okay, we're. Oh, yeah, return sub. It hasn't happened yet. Okay. I think where's Alan? Right here. Oh, good lord. Need to find the key. Saga, do you have it? You wrote Logan into the story. You told me yourself from the dark place. Listen, Scratch is coming. He's, he's close. He's almost here. He's My daughter is dead because of you. She's a child. What the fuck is wrong with you? I'm trying to fix this. I will fix this. I'll save everyone, but we're running out of time. You look I insane. Need is this Scratch? I have the clicker. Wondering. You will fix this. You will save my daughter. Promise me. But can we just yes, read his mind? I promise. But we're out of time. Hurry! Yeah. Yeah, that's scratch. There it is. We've been waiting for you, motherfucker. I'm gonna fucking destroy you. Oh, whoa. He's about to murk you. Oh, shit. Yeah, that was obvious. Oh. Yeah, you put on his jacket. Oh, sh shit, shit, shit. Woo! He was pretending to be awake. Yeah. The plan is fucked. That whole time. Scratch is here. So when he got out, he was scratched that got out. How do I activate the lights? I can turn them on from here. But you need to prime the three power Ow. Yeah, I need to prime the three power cores first if you don't beat me in the fucking head first. That's okay. Yeah, you gotta do a mission while you're getting attacked and chased and beat. Me. So Alan is still trapped. Yes. The containment unit isn't trapped, but the light array should affect him. How do I activate the lights? I can turn them on from here. But you need to prime the three power cores first. We're blowing up these. Hurry up! Ooh. 
He's called me a bitch? Yeah. Goodness. So what about the locket that brings you back to life? That breaks, but nah, I don't want to waste that. All right, next one. To go. Over to the left. Oh, oh no! Yo, this, this man is a problem. How do I activate the lights? I can turn them on from here, but you need to prime the three power. Jesus. I found the lights. How do I activate them? He's coming. Them? I can turn them off from here, but you need to prime the three. We gotta first. work on them the lovers. Ew, babe. Why wouldn't this bitch use the flare? How do I activate the lights? I can turn them off from here. Go, 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 go. We also need to heal. We start with like no health. Another core activated. Only one left. Doing great. One left. I found the lights. Hurry up. Activate them. I can turn them on from here. But you need to prime the One more. Yo, I am so confused now. Scratch was here. He'll be back. Yeah, he'll be back. What the fuck do we do now? Wow. Ish hit the fan. So that whole time, yeah. he was Scratch. So now I'm confused about the... Okay. Okay, bro, my brain is just like absolute toast. No, Hang on real quick. Let's go to these manuscripts. Nightingale entered the ray, enters the lake, the overlap. When did he show up? Which one, which chapter was that? In like the first one? No, the heart. When we, after we put it in the tree. Okay, the cauldron lake overlap. Murder sites. Um, I'm just trying to see. Damn, I'm just trying to, okay. So is Scratch really the one scratching out the words? That's what I'm trying to figure out again. I'm confused or unless, unless right now we thought it was Alan from the past, but no, Scratch actually got out. Cause it, cause it seems like Scratch wrote Saga into the story and he was about to get the clicker from her in prison, but it didn't work. Cause he does, he probably doesn't know that she has siren powers. The seer powers you the mean? The seer powers. Yeah, the para-utilitarian was already in custody. There would be a just and terrible reckoning. Hmm. So was he the one like fucking? So I do think Alan Wake did write the. I think we had the right idea the first time. The real Alan Wake wrote the first return, and then scratch scratched out Alan Wake's name because it's scratch. But yeah, the, but they they flipped this shit on me. My first ever prank on Casey, a true classic. Because notice how he wasn't answering when she was like, "You need to write her out of the story. Why would you put her in the story?" Yeah. Because that's what I was saying. I feel like Alan wouldn't do that. Like, drown that's a girl. fucked up. Yeah. And that's why another reason why the people that were, like, dying in the story just <laughs> stayed dead. Hmm. So now the poem is starting to make more sense, too. squeezed the trigger of the pump-action shotgun. The shots poured out faster and faster in a growing frenzy. Okay. And the reload on it will be so slow. For the rounds, I mean... Well, I have four rounds. They're just going to fire off super, f super fast yeah. now. But I was saying, because um, the poem, it kind of goes back to the poem with like one taking the other's place. and. Yeah. Look, see, we don't even fucking know. She doesn't even know. Scratch tried to take the clicker. 
Has Scratch been pretending to be Wake this whole time? Where is the real Alan Wake? But it looked like it was Alan and then Scratch took over. That's why I'm confused. Wake has been contacting me from the dark place. Okay, where is Wake? He's been contacting me from the dark place. We know that. Scratch wanted the same thing as Wake, the clicker. Sure. Their goals are the same. FBC bot, powerful. Here we go. The dark presence is vulnerable against bright light. At least that makes sense. But then it's weird because at one point the edit had said that the um the the taken couldn't see you in the light. Yeah, they can't. They're weak against light. No, 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 no. I know, oh, but that was edited into the story. Well, it's so always maybe... been, but it's always been like that since the first game. But I, I don't. So I wouldn't put too much faith on that. Scratches, but I mean, like I'm saying, like Saga, it said that he almost got the clicker from me. The whole plan has gone out the window. How could we get this so wrong? Textbook boondoggle. You said it, Anderson. It's a shit show. So what's the plan? So when so when Alan came into there, when Scratch was like, and then he attacked him, was that the real Alan trying to attack him from stopping him from editing the story? When what? So you remember when they had that confrontation and Alan was typing like, oh no, Scratch is trying to kill everybody. I got to hurry up and fix this. And he yeah. started scratching stuff out and writing stuff down. Yeah. And then dude came in there and attacked him while he was like trying to edit it. Yeah. I don't know, I'm so confused. Okay. The FBC usually handles stuff like this, right? Any thoughts? Hold up. You brought a paranatural object in here without telling me and then almost handed it over to a hostile entity? I didn't know if I could trust you. That was a mistake. So was believing Scratch. But it's not too late. <laughs> I just need to understand more. Yeah, you got that right. But Let's man, when you made like a mistake, we were leaning, side, yeah? lenient about it. When she made her mistake and was wrong and got shot in the effing leg. The horror story is changing reality. It made it so my daughter died here, even though she's supposed to be back home in Virginia. Do you know if that's... Uh... AWEs are localized distortions of reality. The area outside town might not okay. be affected. Sometimes they expand, sometimes they fizzle out. If we can make sure it's the latter, your kid might be fine. The whole thing is a nightmare. I can't let my family be torn apart. Having family isn't easy in this line of work. The late nights, travel, alternate realities threatening their existence. My ex-wife couldn't take it. Karen, you're better off without her. I know I am. And there's one more. So tell me what I'm missing. The FBC must know something. Good news, we have Bureau Intel on all of this. Bad news, it's highly classified. Fuck. Good news, consider yourself deputized into the Federal Bureau oh, quick. of Control. Here, Here's the... the cell where we keep the files. Happy reading. Okay. Wow. Um, thanks. Go team. You really don't remember Logan living in Virginia with me and David? Uh, I remember you and David having problems. You needed a break. You and Logan moved to Watery and... And then, uh... Then Logan... Well, that awful thing happened. After you came back to work, I thought you'd be the perfect partner for this case. If you were willing to return to the area. Okay. That's enough. The story is changing your memories. What you're remembering is fiction. Logan is alive. I'm not divorced. We never moved here. I remember the truth. No, oh, no, no. Wake or Scratch, whoever that was, said the story could be used to attack us. We all need to question what's real. With that said, how do we know the story isn't giving you false hope? I can't convince them. I just sure. need to change the story. Listen, he might have a point. Scratch pretended to be wake to trick us. He almost won me over. 
I should have trusted my gut. I had a bad feeling about him when we found him at the lake. When that insane monster cloud came at me in the woods, I saw a face inside it. Wakes. I think he was always a monster. Always scratch. That, it's funny because like when he was in the prison cell, I was like, he looks insane. But why didn't he wait until he got the clicker to switch? I don't know. He just lost his temper. Scratch he thought he was going to be able to, to take like it from her. Manipulating me. What does he want from me? No. I'm in control. Oh, shit. It's my mind place. He's powerful. Too powerful. Just his presence here makes me feel sick. Like a wave of terror through my head. I feel Damn. like a single-minded drive to get the clicker. My man said, nah, you thought. Casey, the thing that attacked Casey has Wake's face. It was never, there was never any Wake. It was Scratch the entire time. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Casey thinks Wake is Scratch. And see, it's not blue yet, so it's not confirmed. Yeah. And has oh, and always has been. Certainly possible. Unless, like you said, that it started out as him, and then they at some point swapped. They're literally. I think. I think it's gonna be some shit where they're literally one and the same, and then he's gonna have to end up dying at the end of the game. That's also possible. Miss you, kiddo. She's, oh, she's so, so cute. I'll be home soon. If only the rest of the bureau knew what a softy Casey is. Happy birthday, Logan. Mom may be gone, but whenever I read this, I feel like she's still here. Saga, for, for what it's worth, I think it's important that Logan grows up seeing you do what you love, what you're great at, that will teach her so much. There will be times just like this when you question your choices, your competence, even your own sanity. When things get dark, remember to trust and love yourself as much as your family does. You won't be perfect, but I know you'll be amazing. Love you always, Mom. All right. Uh, I'm sorry mm. about your brother, Elmo. Yaku was all hard. He always... Went along with my ideas, no matter how stupid they were. Always happy to help. I got carried away. I never think things through. It's my fault. I realize it's a bad time. But I need you to tell me everything about the cult of the tree. The cult is my craziest idea that ever worked. <laughs> Look, what kind of a cult calls themselves a cult? Exactly. We protect water in bright falls. We're the good guys. A secret neighborhood watch. Well, that was the idea anyways. Look, we've always known about the horror inside the lake. When any Taken come out, we kill them. Oh, wow. You don't turn people into Taken. You kill the ones who already have. How long has the cult been around for? Certain folks around here have always known about Cauldron Lake. Before us, it was the Torchbearers. And when I inherited the mission, I wanted to call it a cult. Bad idea. Ba a literally bad idea. It was genius. Just a name did half the work. Made people too scared to go into the woods at night. Oh, okay, well then. Business 101. Fear is a that. great motive. To protect the people, just mm -hmm. keep... It's like the village. Yeah, like you were trying village. to kill Alan Wake. literally what I started thinking Why? about. Nothing good has ever come out of Cauldron Lake. The nightmare that hit Bright Falls in 2010 was all because of his writing. And ever since then, pages of his stories are floating up from the lake, and monsters keep popping out. It's all him, Wake. And if we don't stop him, no one will. Wake's evil doppelganger scratches the threat we're facing. Not Wake. And I will stop him. I've never heard of anyone called Scratch. Oh boy. Oh boy. He's like the he's the villain. He's never heard of Scratch. And he's like, oh, Alan was telling the truth. The cult is after him. Yeah, the cult's after you because you keep sending monsters up out of the effing lake. But then what about the cult that was sit sitting there murdering yes. people and using their heart to open gates? Cult wasn't working for or with Wake or Scratch operating on their own. Nah. Because wasn't there two cults? There was the cult of the tree and then... It was cult of the tree and then um, cult of the word. 
And cults of the word is the one that's killing people. Yes. Ilmo, the cult found Wake's pages inside Taken and believed he was the cause. <sighs> okay. Cult thinks Wake is responsible for Taken and believed killing him will stop this. The cult of the tree targeted people already corrupted by dark presence. Their goal was to protect the community. Cult of the tree kills Taken to protect Bright Falls and Watery. Ritual was meant to destroy Taken, not create them. Uh, so in the beginning, when they were doing that, that whole thing, they were trying to kill the Taken. Keep trying. Purpose of cult ritual was to kill Taken. Wild. All right. I assumed Wake escaped the dark place. Is it possible he's still there? A big apple in an ocean of darkness. Gone diving. Note from my editor. You're using the wrong tense. Trapped in a loop. My friends will meet him when I'm gone. Wake is still trapped in the dark place. Mm hmm. Maybe he always was. All right. They threw me for a loop with this story. And that's the Ilmo said the cult about. kills taken. Is he telling the truth? Surplus deer masks by in bulk. We've got a floater, a taken on the shore. Call the gang Yako. Yeah. We're going hunting. Cult of the tree. Keeping the town safe since 2013. Elmo is telling the truth about the cult. They really were fighting the taken. We're on the same side. If the cult is killing Taken, then why did Nightingale do the one? Private party, invitation only. Wrong time, wrong place. Time to go, Yako. A job half done isn't done at all. Because they didn't finish. Nightingale became a Taken because the Bookers yes. interrupted their ritual. They didn't finish. That's all it takes. I'm gonna deal with the situation, Elmo. But the town will need protection until we sort this out. I could use your help. Right. Right. I'll round up the gang. Whoever's left. That sucks. We won't let these fucking monsters hurt any more of our people. They pulled up nasty. His we'll brother died for no reason. Like, cause Thank she you, thought he was guilty and left them locked up in the jail. So then they got murked. But it's like, okay, I always hate when something just happens because it's like, I understand that you're keeping it a secret, but like, okay, now you're in a bind, bro. Tell us what's really going on here. Yeah. I mean, I guess they were trying to with what By they were saying. By saying Wake was evil and that. But day. it they were it was just done in Vague. a poor way. I think that's. But I mean, he's not mad at us for what happened to his brother. Cause just now, even just now, she was like, "All right, bro." You need to come clean about what Ooh, yeah, this what's is. Yeah, what's going on with the cult and what's its purpose? Like, the minute you got locked up, the jig is up, bro. Just tell us what's going on. Oh, I'm going to run. What the fuck? Listen. And I guess that kind of makes sense. Because you remember in the gun battle, the last one that you had outside of that... I want to say the, lodge? the trailer park or the lodge. Wait, wait, are you talking about when when they shot up the place with Alex Casey and no, Scratch? No, 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 no. When we were doing like the puzzles on the ground. I was wondering why they were running from you. They, some of them in the deer mouse were running away from you, not trying to attack you. And then you killed them. But I was like, why were they running? No, that had to do with that specific puzzle. No, I know. But the ones in the deer mass, they weren't taken. They didn't have like the aura. And the no, they were taken. They were? Yeah, all of those were taken. So why were they running? Because usually they don't They run. were all, every all five of them were running. It had to do with the rhyme. Oh, okay. Yeah. Because I was like, was that why? Uh, but that makes sense. This is the kind of case my ex hated. Yeah, you don't remember all the niggas in the deer mask attacking the shit out of us the whole no, game? No, those were taken. But I'm talking about those specific ones. Yes, that they, they were have, all like, taken. Oh, okay. Okay. 
Transcript of interview with subject, Alan Wake, suspected parauterian. Okay, Mr. Wake, you have been taken into FBC custody and will receive an in-depth interrogation at a later date. But for now, I need to ask, is there anything you can tell us regarding the incident at the hotel? Anything we may need to know? AW, there is a force here you don't understand, a presence. It's after me. It wants to consume me, consume everything. Yes, you mentioned this dark presence before. Why does it want you? It feeds on artists, on the art they create. It wants me because of my writing, but it can be any form of art, any artistic expression, music, painting, film, photography. It can feed on any of it, all of it. You have to believe me. We are well aware of this entity, Mr. Wake. We've been tracking the situation here for a long time now. You yourself have been on our radar for over a decade. I'm sure those nuts in the research department are just going to love checking you out. Hey, make a note to redact that before submission. Let's get back on track. You mentioned the light switch earlier. Where is it now? I don't know, but I need it. I can't end this without it. Will you help me get it? Mr. Wake, you are in custody pending charges for breaching of numerous federal violation codes. We are not going to give you a suspected paranatural object. You're not fucking listening to me. We are listening just fine. Now, do you have any accomplices? Fuck you. Let me the fuck out of here. It's coming for me. We're all in danger. Interview was terminated due to subject being uncooperative. <laughs> That's funny. Oh, wait, let me just collect these. The lake is a gateway to the dark place. What the hell is a para-utilitarian? At approximately 1900 hours on th September 13, 2023, readings from a remote surveillance unit monitoring Cauldron Lake, a known threshold to what researchers theorize is the origin dimension of A040, the shadow, past acceptable limits. Attempts to contact FBC research facility WA03 codenamed the Lake House were unsuccessful. On-site event verification is not possible. Response procedures are initiated with immediate effect. Lead agent K. Estevez will mobilize investigation unit beta from the remote operations site at Redacted. All available shadow specific equipment has been approved for use in the field. To confirm an active event, if an active AWE is occurred, occurring, the dispatch team will identify its nature and severity, limit exposure, and attempt to contain or neutralize the source. If no event is active, check monitoring equipment, perform a limited profile sweep of the area, and check status of the lake house and its staff. For additional information, relevant operatives in the area include the cult of the tree, blank, and Alan Wake, currently missing. Mm. Relevant operatives in the area include the cult of the tree, who is the redacted? Is it Saga? It's possible. Summary of findings, description, power utility. Based on reports, the item is a light switch from a lamp cord with part of the severed cord still attached. Eyewitness accounts suggest that the item possesses the ability to alter reality. The change is being based on blank when used by a capable power utilitarian. Parsing this item's effect from that of the Cauldron Lake threshold responsible for recurring AWEs in the area is difficult because the only reported uses of the item have occurred near this threshold. Without more data, we cannot confirm if the item intensifi intensifies the effect of the threshold or vice versa, or if there is no connection whatsoever. Recorded material from Dr. Hartman after becoming a redacted have revealed that Alan Wake eliminated Barbara Jagger, likely a physical manifestation Is it taken? of uh, probably taken um, by inserting the or shadow, as they call it, yeah. by inserting the light switch into his chest and flicking the switch. The item is confirmed to have been used in 2010 to turn fictional writing into reality. See file AWE 35. However, it is unclear what the restrictions and limitations of this effect are. Conclusion, the light switch is a possible OOP, but the team cannot conclusively classify the item based on secondhand accounts. Proper examination and testing is required in order to determine classification and precise effect of the item. I think that was. Oh, no, that's not something I have to pick up. All right, wake in the clicker. Wake is trapped in the dark place. Wake is trapped in the dark place. He's been reaching out, communicating with me in the overlaps. And our dumbass thought that, oh, time moves differently. Yeah, nope. He just still the F down there. Which makes sense because when we play as Alan, we're still trying to get the F out of there. Mm -hmm. So the only time we've actually spoken to Alan is when we do the little crossover and can't yes. hear each other. Come up with a new plan. Gee, thanks. All the stuff I didn't use because I was fighting for my life for running from this yeah, guy. Yeah, they didn't give you no time. Are 
Are you good? Oh. Yeah. Did I not do this already? Oh. Wake isn't the first person the Dark Presence disguised itself as. The Shadow Summary. Through extensive interviews with witnesses of AWE 35, additional details regarding the Shadow A010 have been discovered. Redacted and Redacted both present during the AWE reported seeing a woman named Barbara Jagger in Bright Falls as, at the time. Jagger is a former actress and Bright Falls resident who emigrated with the filmmaker Thomas Zane from Finland and was reported to have drowned in Cauldron Lake during a redacted AWE in 1970. Research staff have conducted concluded that Jagger's appearance is likely a case of the shadow manifesting in human form. Research is ongoing as to the nature of the connection between the shadow and the psychophysical signatures available for it to mimic. Current hypotheses are... The shadow can only manifest as artists or individuals tangentially involved in the creation of art who have operated within a certain physical range of Cauldron Lake. The shadow can manifest as any individual contained definition needed within Cauldron Lake. Research is actively ongoing. See file 38 453 1873 full report. All right. I need to know what information I can still trust. Scratch pretended to be Wake. He used us. For how long? The whole time? Can anything Wake said be trusted? Are these... Okay. But I can profile them now. Or Tor. Mm-hmm. Wake told me the clicker would fix this. But Wake was actually Scratch. How can I trust anything he said? The artist must conclude his work. He rides a storm on your piece. Wake up and smell the danger. We told you already, kiddo. What Tom said about the light switch is true. Don't let the story confuse you. You need him to write the ending you want. The clicker can make that ending come true. But we don't have Wake. Everything we knew about the clicker was true. He wasn't lying. Yeah, but... That okay. was confirmed by Thor but Tors and Odin we, already. We know that, but like, still, the fact that he was scratched, like... It kind of throws a wrench and stuff? I... There's a page on the floor. No, oh, I there's lots that of pages up. on the floor. Never mind. Scratch told me the clicker can be used to change the story. Does that match your understanding of this thing? Yeah, the light switch is a paranatural item, maybe even an object of power. We have verified reports that Alan Wake was in possession of it during the AWE here back in 2010. It definitely has power. We know that much. I can come up with a plan. I always do. The FBC identified the clicker as a paranatural item. They believe it has power. The clicker can fix this. But I can't use it without Wake. Tor knows about this stuff. Maybe he can help. Wake is still in the dark place. How do I get him out? We live and breathe rock and roll. From the silence of screams. From the fever of dreams. The clicker can amp up other works of art, not just Tom's writing. Mm -hmm. Anything created with passion. The dark power of the lake will make it creep into reality. But if the holder of the clicker believes in the art, they can make it all come true in the flick of a switch. I can use the clicker without Wake. Only Wake's writing can change the horror story. But I can use the clicker to change something else. Like, like getting Wake out of the dark place. Oh. 
So long as the holder believes in the power of the art's message. I will use the clicker to change reality and bring Wake back at Cauldron Lake. I'll need the right work of art, but that won't be a problem. I mean... Damn, I mean, that... he already came back out. I mean, I guess you can use the fact that he already came out of the lake to to make it so that the, it's the real one that came out of the lake. Da, 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 good point. I've got it now. I just need to tell the others what to do and fix everything. So we need Wake to fix the story, right? That hasn't changed. So here's what I have. Wake's still trapped in the dark place under the lake. I think we can use the clicker to get him out. But first, we need a work of art. Something other than his story. And that'll get him here. I'm not filling out the paperwork for this one. I wouldn't know where to start. Get Tor in order to make a song? But I'm sold. Okay. Look, this feels like something that once we get the ball rolling, there's no turning back. You sure you have it all figured out? This is the beginning of the end game. To travel to Cauldron Lake, you need to save your game first. Exploring and traveling to other areas will be limited if you choose to continue. Mm. Oh. Not just yet. Okay. Give me a moment. Okay, Anderson. It's good to know. I'm glad you they gave me you a warning. Ready. Yeah. Is there any unfinished business you think that we have? Just the running around. Um that we said we would come back to later after doing the story. Like the puzzles we couldn't figure out. That is a great stopping point. Since we're entering the end game, the next video will probably be the last one mm -hmm. on Alan Wake. This chapter was crazy. We found out it's been scratched all along. <sighs> Brain is doing backflips again. Like it's just crazy. So this dude, Alan has been trapped the entire game. He's Which makes sense out. because he's been talking to us from the dark place. Yeah, but it, it, you know, our theory could have been true originally too. Oh, it's like, oh, uh, time is moving differently. And then at the end of yeah. this, he gets out or this, this happened before, but no, it's happening at the same exact time. So yeah, we have to sense. still go and finish up stuff on Alan's side of things. We still have some stuff left to do with him, I'm pretty sure. And then with Saga, yeah, we're entering the end game with her. So, okay, I'll probably run back. I probably won't record it because it's like extra stuff, like and grab some like chests and stuff that I may have missed and have those items. Mm -hmm. But yeah, I'm curious to see where the story is leading, how we save her daughter, what piece of artwork we use, if Alice is going to take part in this. There's still a lot. It definitely sucks that Yako died after finding out that they've yeah. actually just been protecting the town this whole time from, from the Taken. They just did it in a weird way. Yeah. I mean, like he said, his plan worked. He called it a cult. It kept, made people scared from the going to the woods, just like the movie The Village. Yeah. It's like, you know, scares the shit it out of people. It's a mental thing. But again, you know, sometimes you just got to let that information out when, it, when it's time. Mm -hmm. All right. That is going to be it for this episode of Alan Wake. And on to the next. As always, like, subscribe, follow on all socials. Abro, Shin, Scrap, Facebook, Twitter, Scribe, Shira. Links are down below. Merch store link is down below as well. So, all we got for you guys today. Hope you have a great day, and we will catch you guys next time. Peace.